up the night. Uh, a week out, how are you feeling? Does it get harder to prepare as you get older? Probably does a little bit, but I feel good. The preparation for this one's been really short. It's only been five weeks, so I think it's probably a little bit better it's for someone my age just to rip and tear for four or five weeks. Uh, yeah, spa through two or three times a week for five weeks. It's a ten week preparation, so I feel good at the moment and have my last spa to stand and be ready to go next week. Yeah. So you're not too happy with your opponent who's not going to fight to your life? Yeah, mate, he's done nothing. Like It's his time to shine, it's his time he gets his moment in the sun with your boxing and craving. And he claims to be this great boxer, fantastic boxer. And he, he won't even show up for media commitments. I mean, we've all got families, we've all got things we need to do, but you know, he wants to dedicate his life to boxing, he won't show up to promote the fight. It's, 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 it's like, I, like I said before, and I, I helped these boys out before, Harry and Sam, people talk about boxing, want to promote boxing, you've got to get out and promote it. It doesn't just happen, people don't just show up on, the, on your doorstep and watch your fight. You've got to get out and promote it, and, and do it that yourself, and for him not to turn up today, I think it's embarrassing, and you know, there's certainly be a little bit extra on my punches next week to, Make sure I heard him and make sure you know what he I guess uh, George said you're the underdog, but um, you came out really short the odds yesterday. Um, you know, do you feel like the underdog getting oh, it? Oh, I don't, I don't follow the odds. I don't even know what the odds were. To be but I, was, I think at the end of the day, he's a pure boxer. There's no doubt about that. He's had an amateur pedigree. He's, he's 10, 10 wins, only one loss as a pro. So we've got a similar record as a pro, but he had that amateur pedigree. He's a very pretty boxer. I've watched him box, I've watched him fight. He's very pretty. He has an amateur style, he's in and out. He's pretty fast, he's gonna be faster than me, but he's a soft cop, I know it. He's not gonna be tough for me. He's not gonna have the heart or the resilience I've got. He's gonna hit, hit me with his best shot, and when it don't go down, he's gonna, he's gonna be worried. And whether it takes me four or five rounds, six rounds or 10 rounds, by the end of the fight, I'm gonna get through him, I'm gonna stop him. And we mentioned your age. Um, have you thought about whether this might be the last, or is there one or two more uh, people well get out? This, this could well and truly be my last fight without a doubt. So I think I uh, urge everyone to tune in and watch. And people who want to see me get beat or see me win, uh, tune in and, and watch me fight. Because without doubt, this could be my last fight. I'm not, I'm not 100% sure yet. Uh, I just want to get the win and, and worry about what's next after that. I mean, I, I've got to say, these last five weeks have been really, really intense. I've trained really, really hard. I'm ready to go, and uh, I just want to put everything I've done into action on the night. And if I do that, I'll win this fight and uh, I'll be able to win the title. Like, this is uh, something I never set out to do, win any sort of titles, but to be able to do it would be pretty cool. Oh, well, it'd just be something I can finish my career and, and be, be proud of. I mean, as I said, I've never set out to win titles. I'm, I'm not like these boys behind me. Uh, it's not much of my sole focus, but to be able to finish, I mean, no crossover star has ever won the Australasian title. So that'd be something. And no one in a hundred years has ever won the Australian title and the Australasian title on the same night. So to win that, I'll be able to crack my own little bit of history at 40 years of age. It'd be pretty cool and something I can tell my kids. He's pushing himself to play a bit of footy himself in terms of him coming to take you out. Is there any bearing in the fitness of that as well? What footy did he play? AFL? Apparently. Kick, kicking the ball around. Next should be telling me he played Union. I'd be real worried. <laughs> let, 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 let the boys in on that. At the end of the day, it's about these boys. And, I'm here to do, uh, have the kicks out their career and give them the platform they deserve. So, have a chat there. Harry, do you mind having a chat? That's all right.